did want to show you uh, the odds for this game because we have a little bit of movement. The Dolphins now three and a half point favorites against the Patriots. We've seen two and a half for a long time on this game. Three and a half now for Miami. I got to tell you, man, that is some deep water. Uh, I got to, you know, <laughs> that, that hook right there is a problem for me uh, because, <laughs> you know, when it was at three, I, I kind of liked Miami at three. And I was like, all right, I think Tua and Tyreek and, and, you know, Waddle are going to and Gasecki are going to do their thing here in Miami. They have been ridiculed, lambasted, talked bad about. Uh, yeah, no chance, hot seat, everything else. They're terrible. It's your last chance. He's had enough of that. And then everybody else is down on Mac Jones, and the Patriots are awful. They look terrible. And then people started, oh, they're going down early. They get acclimated. I think the Dolphins can beat the Patriots, but I'm not one to say that a 10-win team that made the playoffs all of a sudden sucks like everybody else. You know, I'll take 10 wins every year in the NFL. Every year, if I get 10 wins, 11 wins, I'm on Gravy Street. That's all I know. Three and a hook, very dangerous bet right now. I'm I'm not even ready to commit on that, Carver High. Very dangerous. Yeah, I think the only thing that I'm going to commit on in that game, Scotty, is the under, uh, which is 46 right now. Uh, these teams usually play some low-scoring affairs. I know a little different animal now with McDaniel being in there. You don't know what you're going to see. Uh, but I like the under 46 and the Dolphins and the Pats.